storage system today, you have to spend a lot of money and normally you can buy a nice car for that money. So yeah. a nice car you can show your neighbors, you can be proud of it. Sure. The storage systems normally are shitty boxes <laughs> <laughs> with maybe a yeah. more or less nice display on it. Yeah. Yeah. But nothing, you, you could be proud of it, it looks not nice and, yeah. and so on. And we uh, uh, asked the designer to make us a nice housing that uh, everybody can see its quality, its innovation, and its new technology. And I, I like to have this, and I can be proud of this, and I can show it all my neighbors. <laughs> okay. um, and the next target uh, I gave the designer was, I don't like displays because normally you go not to the storage system, switch the display on and see what's going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The idea was in one second I like to see what's going on, what is the status, what is he doing in the moment. Uh -huh. So, And if you see that design, you will see that you can uh, have lights that show you what is the state of charge and you can see energy directions. What is coming in? Is it PV energy, it's green? Is it grid energy, it's blue? Or is it storage energy, it's orange? So with, with what in, you look one moment to the system and you know exactly what's going on without a display. And today we are talking about our brand new Pagadu system. Uh, in the moment, everybody in the world have to uh, put batteries in a row. Uh, to generate uh, high power for the after coming electronic but this uh, caused a lot of a lot of problems you have to choose batteries always with the same capacity from the same manufacturer uh, with the same technology with the same age and state of charge and so on um, and this brings me as a designer for storage systems all the way to borders I'm limited in the numbers of cells, I'm limited in the capacity of the cells mm -hmm. and I have in future problems if one cell uh, will be uh, broken in five years mm -hmm. I have to change a brand new one and put them to old uh, uh, batteries and that causes a lot of more problems. We try to avoid those problems with battery management systems but that's always not a good way. Okay. And we find now a solution uh, not longer to put batteries in a row. We put on each battery a little piece of electronic and this uh, piece of electronic gives us a higher uh, voltage on the outside and so we can put all the batteries in parallel and now uh, we are not limited in the number of batteries and the technology of batteries and the manufacture of batteries I now can build a storage system with batteries from, from each kind of, of, of uh, systems. If you buy today a storage system, maybe with 300 batteries inside, and in, in five years one battery is gone, uh, and the manufacture of the batteries doesn't exist anymore, you have to throw away all the 300 batteries because the system will not run properly in future. Right, okay. With our system, uh, you can choose a, a brand new technology, maybe lithium titanic oxide or whatever is, is common in five years, and put this battery into uh, the block. And uh, this will fit and all the batteries together will deliver power. So maybe your storage system will run for the next 100 years uh, and each gone battery will change to a brand new, maybe brand new technology battery. So your storage system is for the next 100 years all the time state of the art.